Robin Higgins, and this is How Does Radioactive Carbon Decay into Nitrogen? Okay, so first we have our carbon atom, and carbon always has atomic number six, and there's several different isotopes of carbon, but the only one that radioactively decays into nitrogen is carbon number 14, which basically means it has eight neutrons. And the way that it decays is actually beta decay. And so every different type of decay has a name just based on what it does. And uh, it basically just follows the pattern. Um, so in beta decay's uh, part, it basically promotes the atomic number one up, so into seven, which is nitrogen. And it still has 14 neutrons. And then during this, it also releases an electron, and it also releases this, which is an electron antineutrino. So this is your radioactive carbon. And uh, the short answer is that it turns into nitrogen through beta decay. Uh, this is not a very common process. It's very rare, actually. Um, and every time you have a beta decay, it's going to follow this exact pattern of promoting the atomic number one and then releasing these two guys. I'm Robin Higgins, and this is How Does Radioactive Carbon Decay into Nitrogen?